Well, good morning, my friends. And once again, I do thank you, thank you, thank you for joining me. Um, shout out to all of those who have been letting me know that they have been watching the videos. And I just thank you. Just thank you so much. And do pray for me. And speaking of prayer, let us pray. Oh, thank you, God. Today's subject is going to be all. A-L-L. -L. Correction. Capital A. Capital L. Capital L. <laughs> um, how do you make A? Is that A? Sign language A. L. L. Let's pray. Father, I thank you for blessing us, keeping us, providing for us. Thank you, God, not, that not one of our needs will go unmet. Thank you, God, for the all. Hallelujah. The whole amount. Thank you, God. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Thank you, God. I bless your name, God. Remember those who are sick. God, I ask you, according to your word, where it reads that by Jesus' stripes, we are healed. I ask you to heal right now. Amen. Well, like I said, we're going to be talking about all. And the word all means the whole amount. Nothing left out. Hallelujah. That's the way the Lord gave it to me was nothing left out. But I looked up the word and it means the whole amount. Either way, nothing is left out. So we're going to be in the book of Psalms and... I have several scriptures that I want to read to you in the book of Psalms, and you might just want to jot them down. Um, but the first Psalms we're going to Psalm that we're going to look at is Psalm three. Psalm three, verse seven. And I know that I'm a King James person, and I am reading out of the King James, but I just, I, I read these scriptures in the revised standard. So if you want to go back and read them in the revised standard, I think it was pretty good. But Psalms chapter three, verse seven says, Arise, O Lord, save me, O my God, for thou hast smitten. Mm. He's talking about his enemies. How many did God smite? Mm, mm, mm. Thou hast smitten all mine enemies upon the cheekbone that thou hast broken the teeth of the ungodly. Turn to Psalms 7. Psalm 7 and 1. And I'm, all I have is just some scripture for you today pertaining to the word all. O Lord, my God, Psalm 7 and 1. O oh Lord, my God, in thee do I put my trust. Save me from all them that persecute me and deliver me. Psalm 18 and 30. Psalms eight, Psalm 18 and verse 30. L let us see what it says. And it reads, as for God, his way is perfect, for perfect. The word of the Lord is tried. He is a buckler to all those that trust in him. So if we trust in him. How many of us that trust in him, he will be a buckler to all of us. <laughs> Look at a very, very familiar passage of scripture. Psalms 23. And we, go, we are going to look at that very last verse. Psalms 23 and 6. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me. Hallelujah. Thank you. All the days of my life. 
and I will dwell in the house of the Lord. How long? Forever. Mm. So all the days of my life, goodness and mercy shall follow me. All the days of your life, goodness and mercy shall follow you. Oh God, I thank you for goodness and mercy. Thank you, God. Look at Psalms 25. And it's three verses in Psalms 25 we want to look at. First verse is 10. Verse 10, Psalms 25 and 10. All the paths of the Lord are mercy and truth. All the paths of the Lord are mercy and truth. Unto such as keep his covenant and his testimony. Look at verse 18. Look upon mine affliction and my pain and forgive all my sins. Please, God, in Jesus' name, amen. Look at that last verse. Redeem Israel, O God, out of all his troubles. And what I did right there is I changed it up a little bit and I put my name. Redeem Alice, O God, out of all her troubles. Or out of all my troubles. <laughs> Redeem me, O oh God, out of all my troubles. <laughs> oh, thank you, Lord. Look at Psalms 27. And we want verse 4. One thing have I desired of the Lord, that will I seek after, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days. Hallelujah. Thank you, God of my life. Hallelujah. Thank you, God, to behold the beauty of the Lord and to inquire in his temple. God, I thank you. Mm, 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 mm. Hallelujah. One thing have I desired of the Lord that will I seek after, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life. God, I want to dwell in your house. Thank you, God. Look at Psalms 33. Psalms 33. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. 33 and 14. From the place of his habitation, he looketh upon all the inhabitants of the earth. God is watching over us. He's watching over us all. Psalms 34. Now this is my psalm right here. I read this psalm every morning. Mm. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Oh, God, I thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Mm. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Psalms 34, mm. Psalms 34, and we're looking at five verses in here. Psalms 34, the first verse is um, verse 4. It says, I sought the Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus. And he heard me and delivered me. From all my fears. Thank you, God. Look at verse 6. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you, God. This poor man cried. This poor woman cried. And the Lord heard him, or the Lord heard me, and saved me out of all my troubles. Thank you, God. Y'all forgive me. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Uh, oh, thank you, God. Look at verse 17. Uh, the righteous cry, and the Lord heareth, and delivereth them. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
out of all their troubles. Thank you for delivering God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Verse 20. And this is actually, actually, actually a prophecy about Jesus. He keepeth all his bones. Not one of them is broken. You remember Jesus, uh, when he was on the cross, normally they would break your legs. But when they came to Jesus, he was already dead, so they didn't have to break his legs. God, I thank you. Thank you, God, for your word, Lord. Thank you for this word, Lord. Thank you for the all, God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Oh, just worship him. Just worship him for who he is. Thank him for what he has done and what he will do. Thank you, God. Hallelujah, friends. I'm going to stop right there. I have a couple of more scriptures, but hallelujah. Hallelujah. I just feel the pain of the spirit just to stop right there. Psalms 34. God, I thank you. Thank you for what you have done, God. And thank you for what you are going to do. Oh, God, I worship you. Hallelujah. Saints, just lift your hands and worship him. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Oh, thank you, God. With that, I'm going to close and I'm going to say to you, uh, as always, remember God loves you no matter what. I also want to say to you and your family, your friends, your co-workers, all that are in your life. Happy New Year to you. And may 2018 be the most prosperous year of your life yet. Amen.